Hello, I'm Enrico Fratesi from Gam Fratesi Studio. Hi, I'm Stine Gam from Gam Fratesi Studio, and we're here in the Poro stand presenting our new Rombi chair. Starting with the collaboration we had with Pora, it's a collaboration we had for many years now. I think we embrace the same principle in terms of design, quality and aesthetic. And uh, it's a beautiful family business and we have uh, now creating several collections. And this fair we are introducing a new version of the Rombi chair. So the Rombi chair was created uh, five years ago. The first version, which is the very iconic with the cone base. And uh, this year was very natural to make an evolution of that. So now with the armrest and there's also the new base to the chair, which we still keep the iconic shape. So it's still coming from the cone base, but it's kind of carved out. So now it's a four leg chair. The version is quite compact. It's still very generous and uh, you can easily uh, find some good space around. And this, as Sina said, is very comfortable. So it was a natural evolution and something that uh, I think is completely in the collection very well. I think it was needed the way to have an armrest uh, chair uh, to combine to the other chair. And of course, we offering something different to the architect, uh, something different in the house, and it's just extending possibility. I think this is what we like. And together we work very much on keeping the iconicity of the chair, because of course it's a very special chair because of the shape. Also, the name is quite clearly defined, the, the foam. Um, and we didn't want to lose it in this version, but we want just to make it the family larger while keeping the, all the principle of the original Rombi chair. About the feeling, I think it's also something that we can see in the fair, it's something that people really work around the feeling and the mood and the way you stay together behavior. I think these words are also something which is very interesting for the fair and for, for the whole idea about design. Oh, well, I think there, is, um, there are different levels in the phase, of course, where the beginning is extremely exciting because that's when you get the idea, you're doing all the brainstorming, sketching, talking, and uh, you think everything is possible, so that's a very emotional moment. Then um, I think there is a long process of also some solving problems, technical issues, and I mean, it's a very interesting process. Um, you have to be less emotional, a little bit more rational. And then of course, uh, when you see the product in the end, and uh, that's also the very best moment. So it's like, did we succeed? And uh, did you get that emotion that you were hoping for? Passion, research, and curiosity.